All right, we got a good peeker. We have a really good peeker. Jinx. Look at this. Look at this, look at this, look at this. Hey everyone, today in this video, I'm gonna be opening the Pokemon Spring of 2022 Umbreon V10. If you're interested in this product or you wanna find out more about it, the link to it will be in the video description. Here's a look at the tin up close. We got our Umbreon V promo card and we got some great Umbreon artwork. Take a look at it from the side. Looks really cool, great looking tin. And then on the very back, we can learn more about what's included in this tin and we can read about a new wave of heroes. Now let's go ahead and open it up. First thing we have out of the tin is our Umbreon V Black Star promo. Centering's off, but it's a nice looking card. Next we have one online code card, followed by our five booster packs right here, two Brilliant Stars packs, one Fusion Strike pack, one Chilling Rain pack, and lastly, one Evolving Skies pack. Now let's go ahead, let's open up all the packs and see what we get. We're gonna start with opening our two Brilliant Stars packs. We're chasing all things Charizard with a strong desire to get that Charizard V alternate art. We've been chasing it for a while and we've had no luck getting it, but we'll settle for any Charizards out of these packs. Doesn't necessarily have to be the most coveted alternate art. And the Arceus V alternate art would be a really cool card to get as well. And those are some of the most expensive cards in the set. So we'll save Arceus. For our second pack, let's go ahead and see what we can get. And I want to mention the Trainer Gallery as well. We'd love to get the Umbreon, the Sylveon, uh, VMAX cards, or just the regular V versions of those as well. So, can we get lucky? We got two packs to try here. Anything's possible, as I always say, with Pokemon. You just never know. All right, Clefairy into <laughs> Professor's Research Rare Hollow. All right, let's try that second pack with Arceus on it. How fun would that be if we actually pulled the Arceus alternate art out of this pack? All right, let's go. If not, can we get a Charizard? We'll take whatever we can get. How about a Charizard? Charizard, Charizard, Charizard. Evie, let's go, I love that card. We got a trainer gallery card. Look at how good that looks. Into, oh, go lurk. All right, that's a rare non hollow but this is definitely going to be the pride and joy of our polls right here. All right, not bad. We'll take it. I love trainer gallery cards so much. The artwork is just amazing. What a great looking card. Let's go, Evie. All right, the face cam is back. We had a little bit of a technical issue there. I forgot to push the record button on the face cam. What? You didn't miss anything. I was just, you know, super excited for a couple of those polls in the Brilliant Stars packs. But now we're back to it. We have our third pack here, the Fusion Strike Pack. It's our only Fusion Strike Pack, and we're chasing the big three. Gengar VMAX Alternate Art. We want the Mew VMAX Alternate Art or the Espeon VMAX Alternate Art, but we'll settle for any Gengar, Mew, or Espeon. Like I've always said, Fusion Strike has not been very good to me. So it's about time that maybe, just maybe, we get lucky here. Who knows? Anything's possible. We pulled some cool trainer gallery cards already from our previous packs. Toe to dial. All right, we got a good peeker. We have a really good peeker. Jinx, Mew, VMAX, baby. We pulled the Mew VMAX right here. Look at this. Look at this. Look at this. Look at this. It's not the secret rare though, but what a good looking card. I love the Mew V Max. Now we're on to our fourth pack here and our only chilling rain pack where I really want to pull any of the legendary birds, but you know, specifically the Glarian Moltres V Alternate Art. That would be such a cool card to pull. Technically the most expensive card in this set is the Blaziken V Max Alternate Art, but we want the legendary birds. I'm an OG guy, so. We're a little more loyal to those cards. So let's see, can we get anything like that here? Come on, please. Diglett, I love it. Rockruff, Ghastly, all right. Hatena, into Agron. Agron, rare, non-hollow. And last but not least, we have our fifth and final pack and our only Evolving Skies pack here where we're chasing the Moonbreon. Yep, you guessed it. So we want the Umbreon VMAX alternate art. 
We'll settle for a Glaceon, a Leafeon, honestly guys, any of those evolutions. And let's see what we get out of this pack. All right. Come on, let's nick it. You dweeble, rufflet. All right, our Ampharos. Rare double rare pack into our Drampa rare non hollow. Come on. Oh man, I was hoping for something good in that pack. So here's a look at all of our hits. Everyone's gonna get the Umbreon V Black Star promo with your tin, but everything else that we pulled is completely random out of our five packs. We got one V Max, one Trainer Gallery, one rare hollow, one uh, reverse hollow rare, and then a couple of rare non hollows followed by our honorable mentions here of our reverse hollow non rare cards. But oh man, I'm pumped about these two, but specifically I just love this EV card and I really like trainer galleries and we got a Mew. We got a Mew out of fusion strike. So there's not much more I could ask for.